Hello! Welcome back to another video. Today we're going to be checking out some of the best Harry Potter CC finds that I've been able to curate over the past little bit. We've done a lot of uh, Hogwarts and Harry Potter stuff on this channel from Draco and Luna's foster home to Ron's Rags to Riches and even something with uh, Hermione back when Cottage Living came out and then the Harry Potter world and the mods around that. So I thought this would be fun to do an updated kind of CC showcase because I did one of these a while ago for uh, build buy items, but I want to actually check out the custom content for like making your character and stuff like that. So I found a really cool article here at Fandom Spot. This is where I've been getting the inspiration for all this. And I picked my favorites and I downloaded them already so we don't have to deal with that. But I basically downloaded 10 or 12, I think, CC from this list. There's probably like 20 or more here, and I think it's cool to choose the best quality ones and share those with you guys. And again, this was mainly going to be focused on Creatosim. Look forward to a future video where I talk about new build buy items that I've also found, because I have found quite a few more since the last time I did a video like this. With that all being said, let's hop into the game. I did bring in our buddy. We got Draco and his family, Luna, Scorpius, and the dog and the kid. So I thought we'd have a good uh, amount of age groups to be able to check out all that CC. So the first thing I wanted to showcase is these golden snitch earrings. A pretty simple design with the golden snitch and it goes up your ear. It's got gold. I think it's got a few different swatches. Let me check it out in the game. Let's see, Luna. Would you wear these? Probably not, but we're gonna we're gonna give her those today. I just need to find them in my long list of duffs. Hold on. A few minutes later. Oh, there they are. Alright, there's only one color. Obviously. Wait, oh, I don't know why this side doesn't have the snitch wing, <laughs> but that's okay. This side looks good. Maybe that's the style. Maybe that's what they're, what they're wanting, I guess? I don't know. I feel like it should be on both sides, but there you go. There's your snitch earring. I think it looks pretty nice, especially from afar. And while we're looking at earrings, let's check out the Deathly Hallows earring. Beautiful little symbol. Those are symmetrical, and we will have them right here. And these come in two swatches. Nope, never mind. I lied. Only one swatch. I wonder if this will affect it the Oh, oh, we have sliders now on a lot of our stuff. I think this can affect earrings and stuff. Or this is CC thing? I don't know. I don't remember. That's kind of cool. I like that I can adjust the tone of it so it can be like darker. I like it darker. I think that's pretty good. And I will have links to everything in the description below if you want to download. Make sure you check that out. I will have everything there for you. And I will also upload this family with all the CC on it to the gallery. So you can also download them as well. Uh, the next thing, I guess since I see it here in the list. We got Luna glasses. And this is Luna, so she's perfect. She's beautiful. This is her look. This is her style. Interesting. Those eyes are creepy, but that's that's her thing, right? Beautiful. <laughs> you could be totally wacky just like her. So there's that. What else do we have? Next up is Harry Potter hoodies from men. Let me just dig through all my stuff again to find where they are exactly. But yes, let me sort by content, custom content. There. And these are the outfits. They are a little bit alpha CC, so they look a little bit more like realistic. But I really like the texture and the items just look so good. Stop moving, please. And then it's got a bunch of different uh, designs on it. So it's not just one thing. I like this design. Actually, I had a, a wallet that had this design on it. I switched to a, a different wallet recently, but it was like all these on a wallet and it was really cool. So that's kind of neat to see. And then you have your, your house colors, Gryffindor, Ravenclaw, Hufflepuff, that's me. And more just random stuff. Oh yeah, Slytherin. Can't forget Slytherin, I guess. They're, they're somewhat nice. My boyfriend's a Slytherin, so he, he's kind of cool, I guess. <laughs> so there's that. For your men, we need more CC for men always. There's also Hogwarts uniform tops. This is a really good one too. Let me see if I can find that. Oh, I also have these which is a long sleeve shirt version. I think it's by the same people. I'll, ha I'll have a link to everything, don't worry. Uh, this looks like another CC with the Deathly Hollow symbol. Um, and then we have also this 
which is like a kind of like a cool way to wear your colors or like a more modern way to wear your school colors so you're not just so like I'm a Hufflepuff and everything says Hufflepuff but like it's a cool design I like the jean vest with the sweater I think that looks good and it comes in the four house colors with their little animals in the middle too uh, also these are just kind of track jackets on the back I love this mirror that I have because you can see the back um, this is a CC background I can link that in the description below if you're interested but yeah this is super cool really good quality textures love it and then one more uh, sweater beautiful and I think that's it oh wait I found more t-shirts I don't know when I download these but uh there you go you can have a Harry Potter in any color of the rainbow shirt and then I think I checked out most of those oh we do have toddler t-shirts I forgot I did download that I hope yes I did all right hold on a moment let's go to our little buddy Milo Milo needs a, a Harry Potter toddler top heck yeah look at you beautiful so we got that one we got the Deathly Hollows, and then another one super cute and then this one is a dark version Ooh, it's like a galaxy print again a little bit alpha looking especially on this one but the rest of them look like they fit the game pretty good so I like them and I think that's good to have read your kids a little Harry Potter book I do there is a CC for that you can read like actual Harry Potter books in the game <laughs> I think I covered that in the last CC video. I'll link that in the description as well. But that's pretty much all for toddlers. I wish I had more to offer for toddlers, but unfortunately that is not. I guess we could go to female tops. Yeah, let's go back to Luna and check out her tops because I know... I know I downloaded, I think they're similar, or they might be the same ones that I had before. Like, this is a, the feminine top in all the four colors. Beautiful. Gotta do Hufflepuff. Okay, there you go. We gotta represent everyone. And then what else do we have? I have a lot of random CC. I probably should have got rid of some of it before doing this, but I didn't want to have to sort. So we're just gonna have to dig and find it. Don't you worry. Next thing is Harry Potter tattoos. We do have some of those to be able to put on our adults. Let me see if I can find them. Watercolor ink. I don't even remember downloading that, but okay. That's not relative. Am I crazy? Like, oh god, that was not, <laughs> that was not what I thought it was. <laughs> I thought that was gonna be a tattoo, not body hair. <laughs> she doesn't have body hair like that, I don't think. <laughs> Where is it? Am I crazy? Where is it? I know I download them. Is this gonna be more body hair? No. Huh. For some reason, I am struggling to find that. Don't worry, we will be right back. Five minutes later. Okay, so I haven't found it yet. But did you know that there's a cow plant tattoo? Like, I never knew that was a thing. Oh my god, it's so cute. <laughs> I want that. Not in real life, but I want that on my sims in the game. Uh, that's kind of cool. Okay, let me let me get back to focus. Focus. All right, we're moving on from that because apparently I can't find where the tattoos are. So I'll still link them if you want to download them for yourself. But I'm somehow struggling to get them in my game. I even re-downloaded it and reinstalled it and then reopened the game. And I'm still not able to find them. So I don't know if that's just me being crazy or probably. But it's probably just somewhere in the list of all my CCs. So whatever, moving on. There are tattoos. I can't show them off. But I have something else to show off. Scarves! House scarves of all the colors of the rainbow. Well, not really of the rainbow, of the Hogwarts rainbow. <laughs> we have blue, we have uh, yellow, we have green, and we have uh, gray. Just simple scarves as well. The texture is pretty good. It's not quite Maxis match as I would like, but I think it still looks nice. And especially some of, some of these textures are better than others. I like this texture a lot, so I might use that. Also, Luna is Ravenclaw. I accidentally put her in a Hufflepuff sweater, but that was on me because I was like, just excited about Hufflepuff. But we're giving her, her her school colors, actually, okay? So there's that one. And last but not least, we have this fan-made Hogwarts wardrobe pack, which basically, I think I did show a lot of the things already in it, but I wanted to just showcase that it's like comes with all these different options and I didn't do that before. This is the Hogwarts wardrobe pack created by iSandor. Definitely thank you for that. Looks like a lot of people have downloaded it and 
it does look really good in game. So let me hop in and show you guys those really quick. I think this is a part of that, honestly. But the one I don't think I showed you was, I think it was a male one. It's like all these ones. They're like half and half. This one, I think I showed them, but you know what? We're just gonna do a quick overview of it. It's like an actual uniform. So pretty nice, pretty good looking. Why is he so skinny all of a sudden? I mean, he is pretty skinny, but like, I think I wanna put him in a sweater. I like that sweater a lot. I think this is probably my favorite from the other set. If you download this specific set, you will get a lot of different types of shirts. So highly recommend you download this one if you're gonna download anything at all for creative sim, especially for male, because we don't have a ton of male clothing in general. So it's always good to see. And the last couple things I have here are an owl is gonna be super cool. Let me see if I can find it. I think it might be under accessories, hats or something. Usually that type of stuff might be around there. Let's see. Where's our owl? Where do I get the owl? Oh, I wanna give him a scarf though, hold on. All right, you can have a Slytherin scarf, that's fine. It could be, oh, you know what? It could be, it could be a accessory over here. Yeah, a lot of that stuff is over here. Ah, there it is. So I have a lot of spellcasting type things. If you want me to get, uh, showcase any of that in the future, let me know. But oh my God, just imagine having an owl always attached to it. It's not real. But like, it looks so cool and it's good for screenshots at least, right? You can have white owl, like Hedwig. You can have a brown owl. You can have a black owl. And a, I like the textured one. I don't like the black one quite as much. I feel like the gray has better texture overall. And also the brown does too. So, so cool, right? <laughs> I don't know. That's just, that's very unique. I love it. We're gonna give him an owl. There you go. You can have the brown one. Uh, should we give them an owl? Well, Luna might get an owl. Let's get her an owl. Oh, this one sits on the shoulder. I didn't know that. What? Okay, she's she's getting a white owl <gasps> on her shoulder. Wait, why did he not have that? Is it because he's a dude? Dudes always get screwed with their freaking everything in this game. Nope, we do have a shoulder one for, for dude. Oh, you can have them both? So imagine having like a plethora of owls. <laughs> I don't know. That's cool. Okay, no, we'll just give you the one. I don't think we need two. That's like overkill, you know? He needs a scarf though. I'm sorry, dude. I know you're trying to look all stylish, but you do need that scarf. And uh, sure, that works. I like that texture one, let's do that. And the last thing is of course the classic Harry Potter scar. I think this would be under, I'm not sure. Oh, also there's a Dumbledore beard I downloaded apparently. I don't know if we're gonna give that to him. Probably not. That would take a long time for this kid to grow that. <laughs> but it's cool. I'll add a link to that one too, cause it's a really good looking beard. Okay, so it's under face paint or gloves category for both genders. Okay, so it would be under accessories. Um, Actually, sorry, face paint. Let's just find it under face paint. That'll be easier, I think. There it is, the boy who lived, but you're, you're not him, but you know, it's fine. <laughs> we have that one and we have that one. So we have like a fresher wound one and like a, a healed wound. I think that looks pretty cool. He would have a fresher one. I'm gonna give Malfoy also that one, but I'm gonna give him the one that's not as fresh looking. And that's pretty much it. I didn't find too much CC between the last one I, video I did and this one. This is like all the good create us some CC that I could find. Please CC creators, make some more so I have more to show you guys and share. I mean, Harry Potter is a long lasting franchise. It's like not going anywhere. So yeah, I really, really love the series and I'm very excited to be able to share this with you guys. And look how cute they look in their little outfits with their owl on their shoulder, with their scarf, with the whatever, all their looks. So if you have any other CC you'd like me to cover or mod overviews, please leave a comment. Give me a link to anything that you want me to look at. I can test for you guys, make sure it works, all that stuff. I hope you like it. Enjoy Draco being the boy who lived. <laughs> Thank you guys so much for watching this video. I hope you guys have a wonderful rest of your day. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe if you haven't yet. You know, do the YouTube things and I appreciate you. So thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one. All right.